weekend. I am heading out to the lake. I'm going to a new lake that I've never been to before. Well, it's not a new lake, it's just new to me. Um, it's Bardwell Lake, which is about 45 minutes south of the Dallas-Fort Worth area, maybe an hour. So uh, that's kind of cool. I'm going down to meet my friend John. He loves to fish, and he thinks that Lake Bardwell's a good place to fish. So I asked him if I could join him, and he said, yeah. So here I go. I love going to a new location. I love to explore a new place. That's always fun. So let's go check out Lake Bardwell, shall we? So you'll notice in the title of this video, it's hashtag camping challenge. That is a challenge that I took from another YouTuber named Jason Williams. He has challenged everybody that wants to join this little challenge to go camping one one weekend a month, or I'm not even sure if he said one weekend. He just said once a month. So I suppose an overnighter would do. And uh, yeah, he said, you know, tents, cars, RVs, vans, it all counts. Just go camping. But So each month that you do it, your name goes into the drawing. And so if you do it 12 times during the year, then your name will go into the pot 12 times. So. I'm really looking forward to the challenge, not just because of whatever the giveaway is. Uh, you'll have to go check out his channel to find out what exactly he's given away. But yeah, it just sounded like a fun challenge to see if I can do it at least one weekend every month. Actually, it should be pretty easy, huh? Yeah, just give me another reason to get out there. Thanks, Jason. Not much to it. Picnic area. Guess it's good fishing. Not much else to it. Definitely didn't look like anything to write home about. That's adorable. I wonder how heavy one of those things is. Yeah, it belonged to her daddy. Been on a dead leash for probably 15 years. Really? Sausage. Yeah. Then her brothers decided to bank back. I wonder if I could remodel it, which I'm not finished with it yet. I would put awning on it and different things. But it's got everything in there. Get a yeah. How cute. Get a microwave in there. Huh. How long did it take you to restore it? Well, I'm still restoring it. I've been Just working on it part time. Wow. You see, I got a refrigerator there and I got a stove. How cute. Of course, I got a nice man. I got a hot water heater in the back. The bathroom's over there. It had a top bunk that tore all that out because it slept six. Wow. At one time. Yeah, you could, you could, yeah, so where right. do y'all sleep at the dining room? here. Oh, okay. We need this kind of set up. Uh-huh. And I, I tore that top bunk down. I put a new roof in it, new ceiling in it, and all that stuff. It's beautiful. You know, and Ooh, oh. we're just kind of working at it a little bit at a time. Oh, I love the air conditioner. Yeah, I painted it, kind of, and I painted the refrigerator door red. And oh, I love it so much. <laughs> and you've got your little ice right there. That's an ice maker right there. I love it. <laughs> Very cool, very oh, yeah. cool. I got hot water, I got I got a commode and so. Yeah, you put so you repainted it, I take it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Repainted the outside of it. Are those original windows? Yep. That is so nice. The windows original and all that stuff. Of course the doorknob's not original. I had I, it just had a knob on it. Oh, okay. But you couldn't lock it from the inside. Right. So I went ahead and got this, had to cut all this out. You can see with the old one. Uh huh. Then I got a dead bolt right here, so how neat, how neat. But you know, I'll replace some of it. Yeah. She's gonna try to polish all this aluminum up one mm -hmm. day and mm -hmm. Yeah, I love the wheels, every little detail. Tires, You've done the such a walls, those are two hundred and fifty dollars a piece. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm surprised you even found them. Well, I had to get online. Yeah, yeah. But uh yeah, very cool. We'll work on a little at a time. Awesome. Well, that's fun. What a fun oh, project. Fun. We have a yeah. good time with it. Awesome.
Well, thank you for showing me. I love it. I like that old stuff. The old, I tell you what, that camp, like it's a 69 model, been on a deer lease for 12, 15 years and never leaked. That's great. You could buy a brand new camper within oh. six months. That's something oh, yeah. you're leaking on. Yeah, you have to redo them every, oh, every yeah. year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's so great. Knock on wood, it hadn't leaked yet. Yeah. See, if you ever wanted to sell that, you could probably ask, just well, I, name your I price. I had a guy this 20000 for it. Sure. Uh, it's a family, you know, it's her uh -huh. daddy. Yeah. I'll, yeah, I'll, it's I'll priceless. It, no, no. We have more fun with that thing. So you get out quite often in it? Yeah, we are now since I got it going on. We were down uh -huh. at a super nice guy. He just offered to show it to me, so I'm glad he did. Oh, that's so cute. So, yeah. I would never sell it either if I was him. They're just enjoying the heck out of that. Very neat, very neat. So, yeah, you could tell he was real proud of it. He wanted to show it off. Boy, I would too. Yeah, I think these people live here. Pretty sure of it. Anyway, so that made it all worthwhile right there. Wow, I just saw the moon starting to come up. That is amazing. Man, that's so sweet.